My name is Rod Cross and I'm here at the University of Sydney Physics Department. I want to show you a very simple demonstration that you've no doubt seen before. I've got a, a metal disc that I'll spin on the table and the question is, as David Feetonby would say, what happens next? If I zoom in on that, you will see in more detail. I think you can see that as time goes by the disc is rotating more slowly and yet the frequency or the pitch is going up which means that the precession frequency is increasing with time and in theory the precession frequency goes to infinity at the end but of course in practice it doesn't. The same thing happens with a bigger dish and it processes at a lower frequency at any given angle of inclination. I have here a cake decorating turntable that spins freely and I can use that to determine whether angular momentum is transferred from a rotating disc onto its base. So if I spin a saucer for example you can see what happens when you read the paper. <laughs> 